Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Test Drive Unlimited PlayStation 2 Edition. Today is episode number 12. If you guys do want to keep up to date with the TDU PS2 series, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. And also, don't forget to check the description for our social links. We have Twitter, Discord, and Instagram. But hopefully, you guys do enjoy today's video. That is insane. What time is it? Oh, it's only half two as well. <laughs> Oh, awesome. No, that is crazy. 9.4 miles per lap, three laps. Okay, <laughs> let's do this. Test drive unlimited. And off we go. Twenty five checkpoints. That means there's a lot of corners. Oh, Aston's have crashed already again at the first section. I still can't believe how long these races are. Wow. Okay, so we're doing a hairpin corner here. And a very good drift around there. Imagine if there was a replay mode for this game. Oh my gosh, that would be beautiful. Big Ben, interactive. KT Racing, whatever it is. Nacon, whoever's doing TDU, because uh, a lot of different companies have been said. Whoever it is that's officially programming it, Get a replay mode in the new game. I'm gonna have to have it. Mandatory. It's good so far. Oh, there's a hairpin corner coming up. Bad luck, me. These aren't even the longest of races. They get longer and longer and longer. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I think by the end of this uh, championship, we'll definitely be at like 250,000. Uh, 250 miles on our uh, distance meter. What's it called? Pedometer. I think that's it. If it's not, I don't care. At the next intersection, turn left. Turn left. Perfect. Come on, this is going really well. This race is easily going to be 15 minutes, so strap in. <laughs> We're going to be getting a huge amount of lead though, a huge amount of distance ahead of the rest of the cars. By the time, I think we could have done this on an expert difficulty, but um, I me, like a lot of people, wouldn't because if they fail and crash, it's a chance that they just lose everything and it's like 15 minutes wasted. I'd rather be safe and know I'm going to win it than ruin it all on the last lap. Because if you don't get in the top three, you don't earn any money, I don't think. So uh, that's a big problem. Very nice. At the next intersection, turn left. Awesome. At the next intersection, turn left. Turn left. 
Nice. Uh, it's been four minutes and we still haven't found the uh, start finish line again. In one of the endurance races in Gran Turismo, I think by this time I would have done like two and a half laps of the Ascari track easily. I've been moving on to um, like the later laps. Five minutes. Nearly. That's one lap done. We've now got two more to do. This is just insane. Ah, uh, okay, cool. Nice. Coming around the hairpin and so far cannot see any other Aston Martins on the minimap. There we go, we see an Aston Martin. But that is a very long way away. So, result. We are miles ahead. Oh, 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 nearly. Nice. That was a good corner. About a quarter of the way into the lap now. Insanity on another level, this. Six minutes fifty. At, the next intersection, turn left. Turn at this left. point, we have just finished the second lap. We are at the moment not even halfway through the second lap. Nice. And I think by the time we get to the start of the third lap, we won't see another Aston Martin on the minimap again. As long as we don't do like a big crash or anything like that, we should be fine. Oh, we got a corner here. And we've hit rocks. We've hit rock bottom. Haha, uh -huh, funny. This is really good. Got one more race as well. Minimum. It's normally always three races. And this final race will probably be even longer now in games. They always go from shortest to longest. Gives you the best and most exciting progression when you go from shortest to longest race. That's why in the clubs, when you get like a really short race, it is a little bit disappointing. Because you go from having like 4.5 mile head to head to then doing a 1.1. 1 .1, which you found out in... I don't think it was the Aston Martin one. It might have been the Britannia one. Club Britannia. We're getting so many points though, this is ridiculous. Checkpoint. Come on. Alright, we've got a corner here. Nice.
Obviously, this game and Test Drive Unlimited has the longest race out of any game. Not even because of the fact that even though the map is smaller than the crew, um, the fact that the map is much more round, going around the outside of it, bearing in mind from one end to the other is about 35, 40 miles, going around that is about 100 miles. The longest race in the crew too is about 80 miles from one end of the map to the other. So, this is much longer. Oh, I've just realized we're on the uh, third lap, third and final lap. And we've just hit 10 minutes on the clock. At the next intersection, turn left. Turn left. But the game with the longest race time-wise, definitely that award goes to um, Gran Turismo. Any of the Gran Turismo's with endurance events. Oh. Big goof. Uh, yeah, because those Gran Turismo's are like massive. They've got events that last 24 hours. Gran Turismo 4 is an even bigger game than this. It's insane. Up to the corner for the final time. Nice, that was a good drift. We got music as well in the background of the game, so these uh, longer races aren't as boring. Um, yeah, groovy tunes. Makes my life a little bit easier to drive as well. Because uh, drum and bass is proven to make you a faster driver. It one makes it feel like you're driving faster, and two actually makes you drive faster. I just thought that was pretty cool. If this next race is like 20 minutes, I will cry though. Because genuinely, I don't think I have the uh, energy to do a race that long now. <laughs> awesome. there as well. Haven't got long left of this race now. We are over halfway through this lap. Maybe two thirds of the way through. Not quite three quarters. This is awesome. We've been in sort of the same area for quite a while now. But these laps are just insane. Hundred and eighty five, hundred and eighty eight. I was not paying attention, I just heard turn left. Sort of panicked. And at Uma Bay. Awesome, come on, keep it going. Uh, 
And here's the finish line. Ah, uh, third race has been unlocked. Of 14.3 minutes. 14 minutes, 30 seconds, 0 0.029. Wow. And 68,000 credits. How long is the next race going to be? Please be shorter. Ah, uh, thank God for that. Six miles for three laps. Right, so we are here for the Touring League number three, the pro level. 45,000 credits on the line. Six miles per lap. Three laps, 18 miles total. Let's do this. This is the shortest out of the three races as well. I hope it doesn't take too long. Because <laughs> it's been uh, crazy. The last race was uh, 9.8 miles per lap or something like that. So we nearly did 30 miles. I predicted we'd be at 250 by the end of the three races. We're at 242. We're going to be at 260 by the end. And again, for the third race in a row, those Aston Martins have crashed within the first... Whoa! Try to spin me out. Uh, this last man's crashed within the first, like, 20 seconds. It happened on the... the last race happened on the race before. They all crashed, and we overtook them. Because of it. Uh, so this looks like a more sort of... Um twisty windy roads rather than straights like the past two tracks so this might take a while as well six miles of twisty windy tracks in an Alfa Romeo took six minutes if you factor in the fact that this car is much faster I'd say four minutes a lap still that was a good corner it was a good drift Awesome. Perfect. Five more miles and we'll be at 250 miles driven in the Aston. And then we will definitely be buying a new C-Class car to uh, mix it up a bit. We're at 410,000 points. Jeez. By the time we're at the end of this race, it'll be at 4.30 or something like that. Uh, that is not how grass works. I'm sorry, game. That is not how grass works. Ah, come on. There we go. Nice. Got my Discord going off in the background. Loads of background noise that I'm hearing. But the mic doesn't pick it up, so that's lucky. You could just hear my voice and maybe a tiny little buzzing noise. Because uh, I still haven't worked out how to get rid of that. I need to get, like, some grounding thing or something. Somehow need to ground. I think you have to ground yourself. Like, get some, like, I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, there is a slight buzz. There always has been in videos. Um, but I'm relying on the game audio to uh, mute that out anyways. Mostly. Oh, a little bit of lag. This is good though. Uh, the game is freezing quite often at the moment. Uh, oh shit, we're on lap number two. I didn't realise. Uh, so we might be able to do this race in under 10 minutes. In fact, we probably will do it under 10 minutes. Um, we've... Oh! Crap. Went too far on the inside there. Um... So, new car, we're going to get. We're going to start on the clubs again. 
It's going to be fun. I'm really looking forward to finishing this game. And being able as well to say I've 100% completed Test Drive Unlimited for the PS2 would just be amazing. Come on, we we can do this. Ah, no, 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 we went wide. We understeered into that. Absolutely rubbish. I really want to buy uh, one of the wireless PS2 controllers. Because I know there are third-party controllers that are wireless for it. Um, I don't know if they still sell them, or they still make them. But I know there definitely are some out there. Nice! This is really good. We have started the uh, third lap. Six minutes and 30 seconds on the clock. Let's see if we can do this lap without crashing too much. Oh, nice drift there. I think uh, tonight I'm going to be ordering a couple more games uh, for the PS2. I think we'll be getting Gran Turismo 4 Prologue. I might play a bit of that. Uh, a couple more games. I don't know yet. Awesome. As soon as you get past five minutes, no matter what game it is, Oh, crash into the uh, grass again. As soon as you get past five minutes though, no matter what it is, you're getting into like long race territory. It's really good though. If you work out how many master points we've had, we've had from earning just event completes, I'd say we've earned a total of about 1.2 mil credits so far. We've earned a lot. This is where we get across this finish line in a minute, and it will say Touring Challenge Series 4 unlocked. And it's like, no, not another race. 
But I think there's a, there will only be three. Because I don't actually remember there being any more than three. But uh, here we go. Coming up to the finish line. No! I jinxed it! We've got another one. <laughs> I jinxed the bloody thing. Unbelievable. 9 minutes 16.55. And we got ourselves 45,000 credits for that. Let's go to the next one. I did just jinx myself. This one's only 5.9 miles, so this is okay. 41,000 credits. Let's get straight into the race. I still can't believe I jinxed myself, though. Wow. I need to just learn to keep my mouth shut sometimes, because I think games actually listen to me. They telepathically listen to me. All of my thoughts. Well, we got a much better start than the other Astons. They're pulling away now. And is it four races in a row? Yes, four races in a row. We've had a crash. Within the first 15 seconds. Technically, it was including me. But uh, the other car actually was trying to actively ruined my race so uh he can go fuck himself move right i'm gonna steal all those slipstream points then give me them slipstream points thank you slipstream Oh, <laughs> right into the back of the Aston. Didn't even give him a chance to move. What are you doing? Stay back. I wasn't actually expecting there to be this many races, so I might not even get a chance to do club races today. I might just go by the car and then sleep. Because these races have been insanely long. Oh, come on. There we go. Nice. Awesome. Oh, no, I didn't see this. Ah, uh, oh, that serves me right for trying to cut the corner. I didn't see the uh, electrical pole until too late. That does serve me right big time, though, for trying to cheat. Cheaters never win. That is a fact. Nice. Ta-da. Right, three minutes with two or three big crashes. I think we can get this under nine minutes, this race. Awesome. Perfect. It's a really good. Nice. 
Perfect. Look at the speed that we're carrying down this section. A little bit downhill as well to this straight. Means we can go nearly 200. Ah, uh, couldn't quite get to there. The controller just vibrated like crazy when I hit that wall. That was insane. Right, don't cut this corner. And because I didn't cut the corner, I now crashed after the corner. Brilliant. So next time round, we have to really slow down for that corner. Like, slow down big time. Awesome. Come on. Nice. Slow down there. We are on to lap number two now. Perfect. I still can't believe I jinxed like another event that's going to be in this series. I hope there's like an actual like decent car at the end of this. Like an A class something. Something insane like a Lamborghini Merchilago. Or based on the fact that it's touring car, some like race car thing would be awesome. Though I don't think this game has any race cars as of such. They're more just road cars with performance upgrades. Nice. That was a good corner. For once. Road going, there we go. We've done nearly 200,000 points in today's recording session, which is insane. I think the first day I did 110,000, the second day we did like 100 and 20. And here we're nearly at 200,000. Okay, here's the corner. Here's the trouble corner. Perfect. We got it that time. We had to, otherwise it would have been very embarrassing. I can see an Aston Martin around the corner on the mini-map. Nice. And here is the finish line. Ta-da. Um, we got a fifth race. I didn't even have to mention it. I knew it was going to happen. If we get more than five, I will cry, though. Let's just go straight to the next one. 
Uh, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit that join button or click on the merch link in the description. It would mean the world to me. And also, don't forget to check in the description for our other social links. We've got Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. So make sure to follow us over on there. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Bye. 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 B